Hey, what's up, party people? Welcome back to Develop. We have Tyrell and Nick in the cut, and we are continuing with power. We're coming back from the um from the finale. I mean, from the like, the midseason finale, and we're now finishing up the rest of the season. Mhm. Yeah, we're halfway through this season already. It's uh, it was the first hell of a half. Of it. it was the first hell of a half season. There's a lot of really crazy shit happening. I really like the inclusion of Mecha as a character. I feel like he really, but I don't know. I feel like he's just one of those characters that's just there just to start shit. And yeah. He's really good at just starting shit. Yeah, he, he's a massive manipulator playing all sides, but now we know his motivations, and it's to get Monique back. Mm -hmm. To win her back. I love that he's doing all this shit just for love. I think that's really funny. Yeah. Like, a, a part of me think it's sweet, you know what I mean? Like, he's doing for love. But it's the way he's going about it, and it's just going to be so disastrous because he's causing <laughs> so much chaos. Oh, he is. He absolutely is. You know, he just, he's come with a whole bunch. With him comes revelations. With him comes him pushing Kane down a more stupider path. <laughs> it's just, oh, it's just a nightmare. Boy. And of course, there's what happened to Reek. Yeah. Your bitch ass Reek. He got in jail. <laughs> and his daddy sent him a note saying, you you deserve to be there, nigga. So. I still can't get over how cold that was. Like, damn. Yeah, that was <laughs> damn like, ghost. That was like hilarious. Tariq kind of deserved it because he's kind of a dick. I mean, he did, yeah. but still. He thinks that would have more loving, encouraging words. He was like, nope. Yeah, especially since, like, the whole point was, like, like yeah. he got to him because he was the one person that he wouldn't expect, you know? Yeah. Babe, you were my man after Zeke. It's been a while since you might have seen him. Actually, no, babe. I don't think you're a man. Zeke, I hope you realize how much my wife has done for you. Nephew. Do you know? It's not the person. <laughs> Party, right? Well, does he know something? Like, <laughs> yeah, the, like Lorenzo is very suspicious of him for no reason. Very hostile. Yeah. I thought he wouldn't have known him. <laughs> yeah, was he locked up that long? We had the same bar before his bid. Oh, Calito. Let's see that. I did, man. It's my son Drew right here. So what I've been telling you about, Kimo, he's ahead of his time right here. You'll we'll be running the city when I'm gone. Look at him, always oh, jealous. <laughs> and jealousy drives and do stupid shit that makes it even worse. He's his own worst enemy. He doesn't even know it. That's what makes him so dangerous. <laughs> Why is he playing Drew so close? Okay, not now. You know who I am? You're Zeke's lover. Don't play dumb, nigga. I'm Drew's mother. I know who you are. And you're not ready for my son. I don't know where you're going with. You and your big mouth are not welcome here. Get the fuck out of my house. Wow. <laughs> Damn, that was... That was harsh. That was harsh. <laughs> but I get it, because he kind of... He snitched last season. Yeah, so he did. It makes sense that she's like, nah, yeah, fuck that nigga. Get that bread. You'd be in the crib holding it down with the kids. We come a long way from those days. These past 10 years, I kept the business going out here. So 10 years ago. That's why. I just want to want to make sure you'll never have to put in that work again. How? By making our kids do my work? I saw you playing Drew real close last night. He's ready, Mo. He just doesn't know where yet. I want to hand what we built down to Drew. You've been inside for 10 years. How the hell do you know? Definitely not King of Kings of Moron. Yeah. Diana belongs in the classroom. The boardroom's not the fucking block. Facts. I mean, to be fair, he is right. Drew is the best option. As long as the streets. You know what he said about Diane? Yeah. Diane, the, she's not really made for this. She's just made just to yeah, have a normal ass yeah. life. He's the best of both. He has a cool head. He can build. He makes the right decisions. And he can handle himself in the streets. But Drew's got a weakness you don't know about. Mm -hmm. You better talk to him. Make sure he chooses what's good for the family. Okay, so what? Who cares? I peeped him last night. I saw him scoping one of them ball players that came in with Zeke. I know who he is. Are they fucking around? You know everything. <laughs> Welcome home, Papi. Oh. I mean, that's why he's the boss, because he knows everything. <laughs> My thing is, how much does he know, though? <laughs> how much does he actually know? <laughs> is it a quiz that both of them are like light, light skinned bull niggas? Welcome home. Might not be. She might have a type. Facts. Light skinned bull niggas. Don't trip. Because I got drip for you. I'd rather do another bid than throwing any of them funny looking outfits you do. Makes no sense. Well, none of his kids look like him. Yeah, not everyone. Only one that looks close to um, his, 
to, to uh, is Diane. I mean, Diane looks like Monique's kid more than his kid. Yeah, a lot more. Not guilty, Your Honor. Even you're guilty as fuck. Your Honor, these are two cold-blooded murders. Like you literally one did it. The defendant's <laughs> college professor and one in New York City. At least, in, at least in Ghost was arrested. Yeah, at least <laughs> it he was, was innocent. Yeah, 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 he was innocent of that particular mm-hmm. crime. Like he's uh, actually guilty of this one. <laughs> he literally did it. He is the murderer. Not only ridiculous, but desperate. They just had another black student under suspicion of these murders. They can't figure out which black man they want to charge. Black, <laughs> black, black. To, these killings. to be fair, that's a good strategy. It is. ...was engaged in a criminal enterprise on the Stansfield University campus as Professor Jabari Reynolds discovered his criminal activity. What criminal activity? And does she have any proof of any of this? Reynolds was killed with a weapon belonging to Detective Danilo Ramirez. Your Honor, I'm being framed for this, right? I don't know no Ramirez. Shut up. Sit down. Forgive our client, Your Honor. Based on his criminal activity, we believe Mr. St. Patrick has access to funds and is a tremendous flight risk. He has extensive ties to the community, Your Such Honor. extensive ties that literally no one showed up for him today? Your Honor, we request remand. Your Honor, if I... No one. Sorry, sorry, Mr. McLean. I don't have a choice. The defendant is remanded without bail. He'll be held over for motions and trial. They like to make examples out of cop killers. A real welcome home gift would have been a proper introduction to that connect. <laughs> that happened. <laughs> Me and Drew are ready when he is. Oh, shit. Dude, yeah, that's, gonna, that's, this is not going to end well. It's not going to end well at all. This is not going to end Wow. I just scared of him getting out because I know this was not gonna be go well. Yeah. Actually, I am very curious to see what happens when he meets Mecca. Maybe we'll be honest. Yeah. Why you ain't telling me your father was getting out? Because Bobby told me not to. I guess he didn't want to get your hopes up. Uh huh. He told you to steal from me, too? No, I did what I had to do to bring our family together. What you should be doing is thanking me for bringing him home. I killed a man for that money, Diana. And I ain't tell you to do that. Oh, I told you to fucking back us around here. I don't know who you fucking with, little girl. I'm a true husband out of jail, and I'm fucking with you. <laughs> <laughs> what, is there some reason you don't want Poppy home? Get the fuck out of my house. Yeah, this is a good reason. If I kill you, man. You making moves without consulting her, that's the problem. This nigga, I hope this nigga rotten in person. This nigga can't do this shit to me. You gonna take the way for all that shit. Ramirez, you an idiot. Professor, all that shit is gonna be on your fucking ass. Nah, nigga, you looking at this shit all wrong. You think Kane is the problem? Yeah, when I get out, I'm going straight at that nigga. The damage is done. You can't outgun him now, 12 gonna be on you. I'll smart them like I always do. You sound funny sitting here talking about I'll smart 12. You so focused on going to war with Kane that you don't see the whole boy. That nigga ain't your only eye. Who else helped him pull us off? Kane is a shooter, but he ain't much of a thinker. Who controlling the nigga moves? So I had to put this plan in his head and he's just executing. Who telling him what to do? Who was telling you what to do before you sent the ass to Arizona? <laughs> Nope, it's not Monique. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Tariq is going insane. It's he's, not Monique at all. You're seriously blaming Monet for this? It's Mecca. It's Mecca. Yeah, it's totally. He's fucking everything up. Yeah, it's totally Monet's fault. Not the really suspicious guy that Kane's working for that appeared out of nowhere. Not that guy. Oh god, this whole thing is just fucked. <laughs> Why did the police arrest Tariq? Lauren, I'm sorry you're upset. But you have to accept that your boyfriend is a cold-blooded murderer. How do you know that? And you have to accept Very that you manipulated the shit out of this young woman. And you did do that. Are they gonna make me testify? Well, I mean, she has no choice. She has a life that's on the line. <laughs> Some key pieces were captured on the wire. I hope I should get... I hope I, I hope I don't just air it out in public so hard. <laughs> I'm just waiting for them. That's, that's gonna be so good. So you knew this whole time that Tariq was the target. You lied to me? Yeah, she of did. Of course she did. 
Why not? Blow the whole shit up. I want her dirt on to get aired off so bad. Oh, I just want that sh- I want her I want her favorite Zeke to just be headlines. <laughs> Yeah, I, I look at her differently now, Rashandra. Um, are y'all for real right now? Oh, by the way, she is engaged. Cool. Some rapper dude. Tariq, right? <laughs> Can you believe that he shot Professor Reynolds and a cop? Allegedly. Fuck out of here with that allegedly. They fucking perf walked him across campus and we're just supposed to go on like shit is normal? What happened was a tragedy. Since when does she care about Tariq? <laughs> <laughs> right. I guess because he's black, he's a young kid. No bail. That seems unfair and harsh, Ms. Sullivan. A detective's badge was found in the defendant's dorm, which is a shared room. There is no forensic evidence. None at all tying our client to either murder, Your Honor. Another young black man in my courtroom experiencing the vicious cycle of this racist system. But I am a BIPOC ally. So the cycle can stop with me. Mr. St. Patrick, do you work as well as go to school? How is that relevant, Your Honor? Miss Sullivan, I wasn't addressing you. Yeah, like, so <laughs> shut the fuck up. Like, why would you just speak out like that? <laughs> What's wrong with you? What's wrong? How, you, yeah. how, you, how, you try to sp- how you try to speak out against the judge? <laughs> I know. It's like, he's, he's literally the guy in charge. Yeah, like, shut the fuck up. Like, what I'm going to do is release Mr. St. Patrick on a 10% bail bond. You'll still be required to wear an ankle monitor. That's his connect. Set it one million. <laughs> That's power right there. He did it. That's all him. <laughs> oh, yeah. He set it up. <laughs> he set it up. Is that smile on his face? It makes sense. Yep, he did it. He did 100%. Look at the way he's moving. It's amazing. I couldn't even see your hand up his ass from there. Yep. I have never seen Judge Lucas conduct himself that way. Judge Lucas and I go way back. See? What do you get out of this? Save the good brother speech. Like, be real with us. I just wanted to see the young brother Tariq get a fair fight. <laughs> <laughs> he literally told he's you to save He's such it. a full of shit. <laughs> yes. Thing is, everyone knows he's a full of shit. So he must well just be a piece of shit. <laughs> I, I really do think. Like, it's just legitimately hilarious how yeah. he, he really tries, but no one's buying anything. No one's buying anything. Everybody knows he's the full of shit, and he still like, he breaks it up. Like, like that's his default. He can he cannot be fake. Okay, so that's complete bullshit. Yeah. Okay, what does the kid have on you? Okay, whatever it is. Or yeah. See, yeah, he, mean, he, he can't stop being a prosecutor. He can't stop. You can come and go to my office. As you please, you can't leave Manhattan without permission. You have to stay on campus or at this off-campus residence you filed in your paperwork. Whose apartment is that? It's a friend's brother's place. I rented it out to get in custody, yes. Oh. Why, why didn't you think of her before you killed a cop? Why did you do it? How many fucking times I gotta tell you that I didn't do it? Sacks enough! Words, stop it! You yeah, try to get a confession! You're not your a prosecutor anymore! <laughs> like, he can't help it, but, or, like, fucking, fucking Sacks. come at the fucking. Sacks, who the fuck you think you work for? Yeah, you work for him, bro. <laughs> You're not a prosecutor anymore. You represent criminals now. Has changed, so the feds aren't releasing any info until her new location is secure. Just let me know once you reach her, all right? I just, I really need to talk to her. I'm pretty sure she's probably dead, Tom. I'm pretty sure Tommy killed the fuck out of her. Because that nigga's gonna find her. He was determined what? to body her shit. fuck is wrong with you? Word. Yeah, you! First of all, you never ask a client if they did it, let alone attempt to lead them into a confession. Once you know the truth, you can never put the client on the stand to support an alternative theory. It's the truth that ties our fucking hands. It doesn't free shit. Come on. Wake up, Davis. I will bet my law license and my right nut that someone else will die now that he's back on the streets. Have you forgotten? This isn't his first homicide. We get paid to work 
forgery. He really thinks he's a prosecutor. So yeah. You are not a prosecutor, Sex. You represent criminals. Your entire game has changed. Your entire shit has changed. Know your role now, bro. White privilege can save your ass from the law, but it can't save you from the streets. Now I can handle myself in the streets. Kane's seen it. My whole life, my family always thought it was a fuck up. They still do. But I love this shit. I mean, I'm finally good at something that my parents have nothing to fucking do with. You gotta let me do this one day. I give Vince's kids a psychopath, to be honest. Yeah, he, yeah he's complete, like, just, just, him and Trigger are not so different. They both are privileged people that chose this lifestyle. Yeah. Because they love this shit. They're the fucking same. There's one is just a little more out there, and Trigger is more reserved than methodical and planet. Yeah. The other one's a little more erratic. I think he low key's a Tommy in the making, low key. Kind of. Even though I think I think Tommy resembles Kane's personality more like a loose cannon. Yeah. I feel like there's like aspects of Tommy in both of them. Yeah. I don't know why Kane tricked me into it, but I guess we're all in a worse situation now. You didn't want to repeat that ear thing, bro. I saw your face when you said Tariq was out of town. Exactly. <laughs> you don't have the power over him, you think you do. I'll make sure he keeps his mouth shut. Nah, I just leave him alone. No, anything you do makes it worse. I'm making this money to pay Davis now. You have a bunch of rich white people on your ass, bro. Mm hmm. Yeah, especially if anything ever happens to Brayden. I feel like that's a huge liability that no one's really discussing. Yeah. Like, the moment he dies, there's going to be a bunch of people like, wait, a rich white guy? What the hell is he doing over all this? And they're going to, like, get really... Everybody's on the fallout. Like, dominoes. Are you really thinking I killed that cop? I don't know what to think, Tariq. The whole school is talking. Okay, so then let the school talk. They don't know me, you do. Professor Milgram said the evidence they have against you is enough to convict. Listen, Professor Milgram's only running out of must because she's fucking Zeke. Okay, you gotta mm. use the same exact Just like that. <laughs> Just like that. She's <laughs> sleeping with Zeke? Yeah, nigga. <laughs> no idea. Look, let's just. Yeah, he's gotta bob this casually drop for you. You didn't want mommy and daddy to find out that you got caught with drugs in your room. You made your choices. And you didn't warn me about that why. Oh, because you were too busy fucking Zeke? You <laughs> probably shouldn't have dropped that. <laughs> now you know that. You can't just be going spreading it around. Like, you gotta be smart with that shit. No, nah, if I were her, I, would give, I wouldn't even have this confrontation. I would get back here by just telling Word. everyone I yeah, know. That's, that's, the, that's the smart way to go back to is stupid. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, you better this go in a loud speaking, blow that shit in front of everybody. She's fucking Zeke! Like, uh, attention, <laughs> attention class. Uh, do, 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 do. uh yes. Uh, but the teacher is fucking Zeke. It's fucking Zeke. I can't continue to do this. You said we didn't have to stop. Look, he's my husband and the father of my kids. Wait, sure you said the fucking I sacrificed too much to keep my family together. I can't give up on them now. I owe them that. You don't owe Lorenzo anything. He had his chance and that jailbird blew it. Now, I have a son with you too. Nanny, give our family a chance. Don't you owe that to Zeke. Look, I think it would be best for everyone. If this is the last time we see each other. Okay. Word. <laughs> what about my son? I still need to meet him. Can't allow that to happen. It'd be too disruptive to his ball career. His fucking ball career? What about his fucking life? Hmm? If you don't tell him, I promise you I will. Mm -hmm. Stay away from Zeke. You can't really stop Stay him. Away from me. Yeah. I don't think you're not powerful enough. <laughs> like he has a lot of weight to him, you know what I mean? Like if he well, wants yeah, to, he's, I mean, gonna, he's, he's gonna do it. Because if she gets caught like actively doing something to stop this guy, mm -hmm. then people will ask, wait, what the fuck is this? Why the fuck do you care? And not even right. she can't do anything. This nigga, you see this nigga? Do you see this nigga? Yeah, he's you, rich. See, you see what he can do? You see what he can do? Like he's not gonna go down quietly, like I don't know, how come that seems like she don't feel that way? Nah, you bug. That's not true. So, I mean, I decided to pay you tuition for a job. Yeah, he just made things so much complicated. You've been gone too long, man. It's a different world. I, I thought you'd be happy about that. I mean, I'm happy you finally let me go to school, but St. John's, puppy? That's in Queens. I wanted to go to Stansville with Zeke. Mommy thought that was the best choice for you. It's a good school. It is a good yeah, school. Yeah, to be fair, it really is. Yeah. Monet knows exactly what she's doing. She, she, she's mad because she gave up on you, but I never did. She never gave up. 
Oh, yeah, she, she did. She just burned down in the last 10 years. Yeah, she did. Well, she, she never gave up. She did. Why does she have an exit plan that doesn't include you? What plan? Ooh. Immediately. After I got shot, Ma felt we needed a safer hustle. So the plan was once he was drafted, we would follow him out of town to wherever he got drafted to and put the drug game to work for him. Can we talk about this later? I just gotta go out. <laughs> Look at his face. These kids was a normal life. They both kids. Only one that actually wants peace in this business is, is Kanan. Kane. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna take orders from your fucking cousin. Hey, that's the thing. Nobody knew you were gonna come home. You weren't part of the plan. Monet wanted a fresh start. I'm the fresh start. Your mom doesn't fucking get it yet. Once this family starts moving on one accord, everything is gonna be perfect. Okay, but all I know is if you want this family to move on one accord, then you and Ma need to get on one page. Word. Yeah. You're absolutely right. I want to apologize for questioning you, Lil G. I know you with this shit. Hold up, Rick. Got something to tell you. I went in a meeting earlier with Monet and Kane. You pitched me as your replacement, but when they shut that shit down. Mm, so they all working together. Yeah. It was just them two, though. I mean, I didn't see Drew or Diana. After spending time with them, I mean, I still don't have my head wrapped around this whole murder case, but Ramirez and pretty clear you had nothing to do with. I remember... The kid that died in the pool. Yeah. Kane sent that kid up here to kill me. Someone named True Bit that used to roll my uncle killed the GTG kid. I thought you said Kane did that. I lied. Hey, but it was only to protect. Where you. is Two Bit by the way? By at the time. He, came and violated he hasn't Tubit. appeared once this season. Word. Uh, he hasn't hit my phone in a minute, so you should be clear. Kane is the op. Now he's the reason for all of this shit. What about Professor Reynolds? Yeah. Professor Reynolds was supposed to die. You started doing too much. Once the kid died in the pool, he wanted to help the cops with their investigation. And he wanted to write a book about my life. I mean, he, he offered to pay, so... Oh, he's know. really good. He's finally telling the truth. It's about fucking time. It's about time. time. It's Jesus. About time. I thought I would never see the day. I'm, star I'm, I'm shocked. I'm in shock. The day Tariq finally tells the truth. God damn, it's almost over. Shit. Yeah, that was quickly. It felt quickly for me. I don't know about you. Professor Reynolds was supposed to die. At least the quickest we ever got through a power episode. He started doing too much. Once the kid died in the pool, he wanted to help the cops with their investigation. And he wanted to write a book about my life. I mean, he offered to pay, so I met up with him. Kane followed me, and he overheard him ask if Drew killed the GTG kid, so he came out of nowhere and blasted Reynolds. Then put the gun on me. Same exact gun he used to kill Ramirez. Wait, what? Told him I'll finish Reynolds. Help him with everything if he didn't kill me. What's up, man? Why'd you go so hard for me not to bring Drew? Where the fuck is the connect? Just so he like connects you. <laughs> the other way, it's okay. Donde está te digo? Como me oyes? As far as you're concerned, I am the connect. I look at this angle of cojones. Because when shit goes bad with this connect, and it will. Bring that same fucking energy. Didn't have to be this way. You chose Drew over me and you lied to me. Okay, you said I needed to learn the business so I can take over. You're not fucking ready. You're not ready. You <laughs> back home, you don't have shit. You're living off my mother. So, what are we talking about, man? He's gonna get that power back. <laughs> it's gonna happen. <laughs> Of course I got enough. He just came out of fucking prison. Yeah. Wait, he's gonna come back just like the man already? No, he has to gain <laughs> that shit back. And he will. You're my son. I still love you. But this fool's right here. White choice is the right choice. Nope. You never think things through. Never. <laughs> <laughs> never. Never think things through. Ugh. Who we talking about? You're my son. I still love you. This fool's right here. Why Drew is the right choice? You never think things through. And you can't play your own role, Kane. I see you kept the family going, and I respect that. I know you have a purpose, Kane. Okay, so it should be me by your side. Not true. Okay, you and I both know he's not built for this shit. You want to be at my side, then why you keep blocking this connect from me, man? What the fuck do I look like to you, man? Make up your mind, Kane. Are you trying to be my boss? Are you my son?
Bitch, she call me king, I'm a wedding crown. Oh. Oh. Now he wants to be. Shit. Oh, that's not good. What do you even know that that's just that's connect? Dude, I want to see the next episode. I feel like as long as he's around, you won't be safe. I already know what I gotta do. Just, I don't wanna take that route. You know, if I kill Kane now, I'll still lose anyway. Can I show you something? The fuck is that? I'm still letting my dad live for me in case I end up in jail. I got it my first night in. He knew me better than I knew myself. Maybe he didn't know you at all. The story's not over, Reek. It's just beginning. I need you in when they call me. I say thank you for everything. Of course. I know you'd end up here, little nigga. Right where you belong. Okay, so that was episode six. What do you think, Nick? I thought it was pretty good. It was a pretty good episode. Like, it's definitely not as good as the as like just the heights that season, episode five was. Episode 5 had a lot of really crazy shit. This yeah. had some good shit, though. Like, it really did the... Like, I'm looking forward to seeing uh, Lorenzo and Mecca meet. Yeah, I'm really looking forward to that. They do... Oh, man. Yeah. Oh, man. I mean, I do like that they gave, like, an episode just so Lorenzo could just, like, be alone. Like, could just be home. Yeah. You know, readjust. Mm-hmm. See how everyone reacts to him. Like, all the different reactions among the family. Yep. 100%. <laughs> Yeah, I agree. I, I, I agree. With, I agree with everything. You know, uh, I like how he reread that note. <laughs> like, it's like, it's just, yeah, it's just, just, he it's just, just like edged in his brain. <laughs> yeah, he's like burning it over dramatically. Like, yeah. I'm like, you're not worried about the fucking fire alarm, man. <laughs> Wait, man, that was episode six, man. It was great. Mm-hmm. Uh, if he came back from out of nowhere and he had sex, and now she's part of the team. Great. She we have a reason to keep her around. But yeah, man, I... Uh, it's a lot to unbag. It is. Like, a lot happens. A lot happens. And that's all these episodes. they bloated. But still kind of well-paced. Yeah, mostly well-paced. Yeah, my thing, how, how Monique's going to readjust, I don't think... I don't think... Th- Why do I, you keep calling her Monique? Because I know Monique's just keeps saying Monet. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and um, honestly, and not even just, like... Like yeah, so Monet is like she's really just it because she she wants she she likes that power and she's really admitted to herself she likes being a boss mm-hmm. and the, the way he's going he's just really complicating shit and I don't see him surviving past this season to be honest because <laughs> he's giving in a lot of people's lives. There's a lot of people who I think are on the chopping block for season two. Oh yeah, hundred percent, hundred percent. I was waiting for that secret to fucking of him fucking teacher like, I want that to be splattered across every publication no. <laughs> dude in Stansfield I swear yeah she, she really deserves it yeah she does yeah but anyways that's episode 6 see you guys in the next episode if you like mm-hmm. this give us a like and subscribe um, follow our Instagram handles Twitter handles stay tuned for more content yeah peace out folks we'll see you next time peace out y'all with more content more content yeah, you ever like um spray a little DNA on Lance Bass's tramp stamp just to feel alive.
I was on the website Celebrity Net Worth, mm -hmm. and it says that yours is 14 million. I don't know what the f you're talking about, but. 